just to your point about the granular detail of incidents, I mean, certainly we have done, and I'm sure my colleagues in other operators have done, we've looked at time of day, time in shift, and all that sort of thing, and it would have been fantastic if there had been some direct correlation. We could have said, ah, oh, that was always at the end of shift after they'd done like 12 hours. It was completely randomised. It was extraordinary. There was no, there was no clear pattern, unfortunately, which was not very helpful, actually. But in terms of... Um, I mean, one of the other questions that may come up, incentivising safety. How do, how do the operators uh, act in the right way? What, what um, strictures are put on us to, make, to force us, if you like, to look the right way? The safety performance index, I think, has done possibly more than even maybe it was intended to do in, in terms of not having a direct incentive, but what other mechanism could you put in place that would get operators doing the right thing? The safety performance index across its how many 40-odd... Uh, different KPIs, huge basket if you like. We and I know my colleagues are out there trying to improve each one of those measures to get our safety performance index score up. Now I can say for ourselves we have seen a steady increase over time which is exactly what it was designed to do mm -hmm. but I think across the network we've also seen an increase mm -hmm. and it is focusing our minds on the right things and you, you know you can't just go and cherry pick, you've got to do all of those measures. It's no good being brilliant in three and rubbish in the rest. You've got to tackle all of them. I'm just mindful of time. I've got quite a number of colleagues that want to come in. So I would ask Thank that the assembly members exercise your strength. We've got, we've still got four sections to cover on this area. Um, assembly member Copter, assembly so member I will exercise your strength by not asking. Oh, okay. Thank you. Um, <laughs> can we move on then?